everybody Belinda here and welcome back I'm hoping that there's enough light here it's a very very miserable day today and of course I'm going to be experimenting and let me show you my colors first I have um, this kind of plum color and um, my 24 karat gold and again none of my metallics are extreme sheen so I have this dazzling pink which is also um, it's not metallic but it actually has um, like a dusting of glitter in it and I just have an um, ordinary red or PBA and I have white just a little bit and I've mixed that with a bit of my metallic white pearl this is the amethyst which is a beautiful beautiful color again metallic crystal green Deco art and um, so I bought this one today which I thought is absolutely beautiful it's an ice blue metallic Deco art none of them are extreme sheen but they all give the same effect really as the extreme sheen so what I'm planning on doing today is a flip cup and for that I'm going to be needing about 200 moles and in no particular order I'm going to pour it in the cup I think what I'd like to do actually um, Decisions, decisions <laughs> I'm the type of person when you give me too many choices I'm at a loss <laughs> I kind of don't know what to do. <laughs> and I have a lot of choices of colours here today. So I think what I'm going to do is just go in with the white first. Um, and I'll go in with some red. So I'm going to layer it. And in between the layers I'm going to put my gold which is a 24 karat gold it's deco art it's not extreme sheen so it is a bit thicker and i just really want to put it down the sides of the cup in layering it because i don't want to what i'm trying to actually obtain is um gold on the, the edges and hope, I'm hoping that of course you know because it's an experiment I'm hoping that it's going to be rings of pearl cells but being an experiment we'll see how that goes so I'm going to put a bit more of the gold around and I'm hoping it's not going to be too much gold either because you know if you have too much gold it kind of takes over so I'm just trying to stick to the outside and see how well that's going to work um, put the pink in the middle Yes, I'm hoping to have rings of colour. I guess I should just use as much as I can. Although I think this cup is bigger than a 200 ml. So 
So we've had a lot of rain going on. Kind of um, on and off mostly. I know in one of my previous videos um, somebody thought that perhaps I was living by the sea, by the ocean because it was um, it obviously sounds like that it would be nice if that was the case so I'm just going in with some of this plum and I've actually ordered online some new paints Oh, and I'm dying to get them unfortunately not being in America we have to wait forever and a day for anything I suppose it does have to come a long long way all the way to New Zealand so I can't wait to try that I think it's going to be pretty exciting. And I might go in with some blue now. I love this blue. This is that ice blue. And it pretty much looks like ice blue as well. So doing this flip cup. Oh. Um, we normally get all sorts of other things happening that you don't want to happen because you can't control the outcome but let's see it's a good experiment So I'll go in with a little bit more gold and then finish it off with this beautiful amethyst purple. So this canvas is a 12 by 16 inch. That's better. Perfect. I'll just wait for it to come out a little bit and make sure all of it's out. So I'm, I'm thinking I'm not going to drag it because you know I don't like that centerpiece that it normally makes when you drag. So I'll probably just lift it straight up. So remembering also that there's no silicone in here and it looks like quite a, a lot of cells going on which is awesome. I'll just cover these corners a bit. Look at those gold cells in there. See if you can see that.
There's this paint that's coming out of this cup. It's actually looking really beautiful. I just, I have a feeling it's not going to go the way I wanted it to. But I think it will be beautiful all the same. Let's give it a quick torch. See this red has got quite a couple of cells as well, which is really nice. So I'm just going to go around in circles a bit first. Yeah, I have a feeling that this is all going to roll over itself. So we're just going to put down some gold. And this is the plum. Sorry guys, I know you're off screen. This is looking really pretty. It's not quite what I was after, but it is really nice. Let's go off there. These colours are just superb. So it's been sitting for a little while now. And probably about 10 minutes. You can see all the beautiful cells that have popped up. There's a whole string of pearl cells down there as well. I think the outcome is really beautiful. All these little pearl cells and quite a lot of the cells are in you know various colors that I used so 
So I'm quite happy with the way this turned out actually. It's very striking. And I love this part here as well. That's pretty awesome. I'll just show you from a different angle. I think that's probably going to be the correct angle to hang it. Purely because it looks 3D. Yeah, so it has this amazing 3D effect to it. Well guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye.